hello good people welcome again to this channel uh, and today I want to show you how I maintain the length of this hair of my daughter so you're welcome as we do the unbraiding and then after I'm going to show you how I detangle her hair after unbraiding uh, the hair you are so much welcome good people and remember to subscribe to this channel also like the video and hit the notification bell for more of this kind of video uh, now I'm going to, um, to unbraid her hair uh, this hair has been like this for has been braided for like three weeks and now today I decided I want to unbraid uh, the hair because I'm free so uh, after unbraiding the hair the hair will be so dry and so tangled so keep it there as you watch and see how i detangle her hair and comb it comb it uh, very well to stop breakage also as as you watch this video being the christmas season I want to wish you a Merry Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. If it is your first time uh, visiting this channel, you're so much welcome and remember to subscribe uh to our channel for more of the hair growth tips so now this is how her hair looks after unbraiding and first i'm going to moisturize it using plain water remember after unbraiding the hair is very very dry uh, so i'm going to moisturize it very well i'm just using plain water Add more water if you feel the hair is not well moisturized. And then now I'm going to use the normal hair conditioner uh, and apply it to her hair. This is the normal hair conditioner that we use after we wash. Uh, we shampoo our hair and then we use the conditioner to detangle the hair after wash so for me um, I'm using it to detangle her hair before washing so that I can comb it very well to stop hair breakage yeah after you apply the conditioner remember to massage well uh, the hair so that the conditioner can be well uh, so that uh, the hair can uh, get the conditioner well and then after you feel the hair is well conditioned then uh, the next thing is combing it and remember you have to be gentle as you comb it
and this is the process that I normally use whenever I whenever I unbraid her hair before washing that's how I do and at the end you will see that the hair uh, will not break that much uh, it will be just the normal uh, hair breaking after you comb it well as you can see uh, the hair is combing very well and you can check our before picture is right there you can check it how the hair was before and now so you can see if you could try to comb her uh, the hair before moisturizing it and before applying the conditioner it could be a very painful to the child and also it could break much and as you can see the hair is well uh, detangled now as you can see the uh, as you can watch in the video and this is the amount of the hair that has broke break after combing so this is just the normal black so now after washing her hair this is how the hair looks Uh, yes, I have shampooed her hair and later then I have also applied the conditioner and then then now here I'm going to apply this leave-in treatment uh, To her hair. This is the one that you apply after washing the hair and you don't have to rinse to rinse it out You just leave it to the hair so after washing and conditioning your hair then you apply this ravine treatment it's very good uh, it strengthens the hair and also it detangles the hair wow this is how the hair looks remember i've not even broad dried the hair